smelt something. Green skins incoming. Remember, the Emperor hates the Xenos. Yeah, except for that one time he fucked Maka. That is not canon, you heretic. <laughs> Like, really, there's a lot of people who fuck the ever virgin that is Maka. <laughs> As you wish, so shall it be done. Well, you know, some people seem to appreciate virgin beauty for some for some of their kinks. I don't know. If you had sex or not, I don't give a fine fuck as long as you're kind of pretty. Well, actually, in your case, the level of standards. Yeah. Also, you wanted to bang a fiend of Slanesh. I mean, it doesn't even have I mean, to be. If it was, if it came down to it, like you guys had a chance to escape, oh, no. while I had to fuck this creature. I guess I would have to choose the the higher road. <laughs> like my, uh, you know, like my space marine strategy of just sitting behind the guardsmen as they die. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you are such a dick! Wow! <laughs> Deploy the scout tank. The Bane Blade. <laughs> Three minutes until control... The Marines got there just to steal the credit. <laughs> I just don't even understand how I wasn't hitting that guy. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, the assault marines touch down as the guardsmen finish. Yeah, the guy, there was like there was like ten HP left and hit it with a chainsword and it died. <laughs> Gonna be a very interesting match here. Command me to build. I don't know what you mean. That'd be interesting for me at least. <laughs> You're fighting the Tau. How bad can it be? No, it's one Imperium, two Tau, and then an Eldar. Oh, um. And the Eldar in this game are assholes. Fucking Tau. Oh, and yeah, their the tau stupid invisibility. Suits. The Tau have their stealth suits. Oh, yeah. Oh, my I completely God. forgot about that. Tau should not be this resilient. Yeah, maybe we should restart this one. Fair <laughs> enough. Okay. I'm Unless playing like random backwards. I'm playing typical Eldar strategy of using the Monkai as a buffer. <laughs> you are brown Eldar. <laughs> yes. <laughs> this is my brother's paint scheme for when he created his Eldar army. Brown oh Eldar. God. What the fuck? <laughs> he wanted them to be like tree spirit Eldar, like uh. Oh! <laughs> like, uh, fantasy. Wood elves! You mean he wanted them to be wood elves? Yeah. The wood elves don't wear brown! They wear tree bark! They well, have green all over them! Well, his army is brown. He also got inspired by New Zealand Maori, like the native designs. And it's got Oh man, you and can see how now bad I, my base is invisible. That's not right. How would you find it? You need units of infiltrate or uh, counter infiltrate ability. Oh, okay. Bone Singer can teleport? What? My builder units can teleport. That's bullshit! Yeah, the Eldar are the most OP faction in Dawn of War. I mean, they should be, but still, that's. I've seen it argued that it's the uh, Imperial Guard because of just how much fucking bodies that they can throw at people. No, that's actually a pretty good argument. Now that you think about it. <laughs> that was a good one. Fucking. Uh... This little gorge thing right here is just a sea of bodies right now. Yeah, it is a rather a big sea of red. Oh, really? Okay. I love how chaos these fucking chaos guys have the ability to find my fucking bone singers automatically. It's like fuck you. I like the Chaos Sorcerer charges in, detonates the psychic power, and then dies. 
from the 500. Yeah, he uh, he got disintegrated. Uh, I turned off the camo cloak around my base because it was starting no, to was like yeah! to me. <laughs> I was starting to loathe that sound very intently. The amount of anti-tank defenses. Ooh. I'm gonna retreat back up to the heavy bolt curse. <laughs> and I'm gonna upgrade the back two for uh, missile. Oh, out the way, brothers. Oh, are you? My vehicles are so stupid that they're not. They can't work out how to get past the defenses. Okay. How about all of you fly over the defenses since you're all fucking jet aircraft, and then fly over? It's like, it, it makes me sad. It's like respect my bolter, bro. Says the guy who's complaining about having a bolter. Fuck. Hypocrite strikes again. Oh yeah, I love how like uh, eighty percent of these of this game is voiced by one person. That's <laughs> what. Hey. What do you mean? Oh yes, there's a voice actor. Sorry, I was thinking. Voice? What? What do we? What do we mean by voice? Because <laughs> like almost all of the ground units are voiced by one guy. <laughs> that one's dead. I destroyed their base. Oh, nice. We only have the Emperor's children to deal with now. The Wraith Lords in this game are the old models where they had the goofy little proportions and shit. Yes. Fortify. I look forward to the day when I can convince uh, Kiwi though to read a fan fiction. That's gonna be funny. <laughs> we'll all get drunk one night and just read a fucking fan fiction. That actually sounds like an amusing evening. Oh, she's like, he knows she's there, but he doesn't know that she's a Xenos. <laughs> and he, so he's just like, this angel is dancing on my head. She can dance. <laughs> oh shit! I fear the emperor's wrath. <laughs> my bad. I forget the fire prism cannon knocks people down. Did you just knock down all his people? Yeah. Oh no. That was only the melee ones, which is only half of them. Okay, so this is going to turn into a meat grinder, but we should probably remember that we need to fit vehicles through. So we might need to put stuff back slide through. What now? Well, if it's all going to become a meat grinder around the central point, and last time we couldn't get tanks through or infantry because of pathfinding. You might need to build stuff slightly back from the breach. Or just more organized, like in a row. Their first squad is over by the uh, opening now. Yes, I'm sending three squads of cultists. I think we might have just lost a little bit of control over the situation. Uh, yes. I think we've actually lost. We could probably actually chalk that up right now, but I think the yeah. fact that they're able to get this many fucking squads, plus their commanders already, makes me think this is Age of Empires 2 logic, where they're just given automatic fucking resources because of an, instead of increased probably. difficulty. Instead of increased difficulty. It probably just increases their resources and aggressiveness and changes what units they like to produce first because yeah no we lost yeah radio and change it out of uh, 